Hey everyone, welcome back to another video today. Today guys, we got some Fortnite on the Switch. And well, this is great guys, this is great. So what I guess Epic decided to do, and like Sony as well, is that if you ever, if your, if your account ever touched a, your, your Fortnite account, your main account ever touched the PlayStation, the PSN or something like that, you ever cooked it up or anything like that, you're not allowed to play on the Switch because of cross-platform. Even though that's a little weird and Sony's stubborn, you could, I guess, kind of see that. But the thing is, mostly I'm a PC player. My account was made on PC. I literally, this past weekend, I hooked it up once to my PSN. I played like three matches and then I disconnected it. Like I've already tried disconnecting it. Apparently, I, I a lot of people on Twitter are complaining about it. So I thought I would just bring, you know, some attention to it. So whenever like I disconnected it, I still cannot sign in like it's it's because it says your account cannot play this platform please see our help website for more information my account isn't hooked up with playstation it never i mean i hooked it up for like a short fat minute but other than that like my account was made on pc i'm mostly a pc player and the fact that like i'm getting screwed over by this a lot of people think it's sony's fault it is partly their fault but epic i think this is a glitch right here i'm positive this is a glitch because my my account has touched PlayStation once. Even if maybe if your account like was mainly PlayStation or you created on PlayStation, maybe this could be argued until Sony just blows this over. But the fact is that my account was made on PC. It's mainly a PC account. And if you I think you should be allowed to disconnect your PlayStation account so you can move over to like something like the Switch or something like that. Because um that's that's exactly what I did, but apparently you can't do that, so I can't get all my PC stuff. I, all I can do for my challenges is just wait till, just I guess just play PlayStation. But the thing about it is, is like I don't want to play PlayStation. I don't really like. I don't actually. I prefer this version of Fortnite over than the PlayStation version. That's just my personal preference. I prefer PC overall, but that's just my personal preference. But I think this is really dumb, and Epic should make an option to because you know Sony. Sony is very stubborn about certain things, but once they start losing money or once people start complaining enough, usually they'll listen. Like the whole Fallout 4 mods, it came to Xbox, but it wasn't originally going to go to Sony. Like it wasn't going to go to uh, Sony at all because Sony didn't want mods, but then they're like, oh, okay, man, we're fine because a lot of people complained about it. The whole Spider-Man situation because once they failed the Amazing Spider-Man, guess what? They turned it over to Marvel. When Sony fails, they usually start to listen. So hopefully some other way... They can allow this to come back, or Epic can fix this. Might I think this right here is a glitch? Because if you disconnect your account, you should be able to hook it up to Nintendo just by disconnecting it. If you have the two accounts connected, maybe you could until the whole thing Sony blows over. But I've already disconnected my PlayStation account. Like I've already done that. I've made sure I've signed back in. It's my account, my Steam account. I'm mean, sorry, my regular PC account and uh, this account are the only ones who, that are connected. And it still, you know, says this message. And I think that Epic really needs to fix this contact Sony or something like that. Because I'm not rebuying the Battle Pass. And it kind of sucks just, you know, being a default skin and having none of my options to play. None of my dance emotes. None of anything like that. It kind of sucks. So, that's kind of disappointing. I just want to make awareness. I know some people are kind of just like, Xbox users are rubbing in a PlayStation face. But the thing about it is, it's like, I don't, I don't, I don't even get on PlayStation. I barely mainly use PC and then I still have to go through this but I don't know it's just kind of annoying but anyways thank you guys so much for watching hopefully 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 epic can fix this issue I mean maybe not do cross-platform but allow PlayStation either PlayStation users or this whole glitch where you can disconnect your PlayStation account just so you can sign in on the Nintendo Switch would be great because I don't mind disconnecting and reconnecting but it, once this goes on the switch once my account goes on the switch my uh, my old one i probably won't be disconnecting because there's no reason for me to play playstation other than maybe a couple friends but sony's just being stubborn so just keep a lot of people say stop complaining but i say hey, just keep talk just keep nudging them and i guarantee you they'll eventually open up that is just so that's just sony in general they'll but once you start hitting them then they're then they're then once you start hitting them in the wallets then they're going to start to listen so but anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching, and that is all. Love you guys. Bye.